First, we'll adjust the ratio. The ratio determines how much the loud sounds are compressed. Right now, it's set to 1 to 1, so there's no compression applied to the sound. Set to 2 to 1, the compressor would cut the volume that exceeds the threshold by a half. Set at 6 to 1, the audio will be compressed to 1 sixth of the original excess volume. For dialogue, you're usually looking for a ratio of around 6 to 1 to 8 to 1. The threshold determines how loud a sound needs to get before it's compressed. I'll press X to select the audio, then use the forward slash key to loop through the clip and watch the audio levels. Dragging the threshold down, we get visual feedback of when and by how much the audio triggers the compressor. I'll adjust until I'm happy that the loudest sounds are triggering the compressor, but not the quieter ones. Then pause playback. One of the really nice features of Final Cut Pro 10 is the ability to see the effect of your changes instantly on the clip's waveform. Notice as you adjust the threshold, you can visually see the extreme peaks of the waveform being compressed, while the rest of the signal remains unaffected. Let's set the threshold to around minus 28 dB. Listening back, you can hear that the dynamics of the scream and whimper are much more even.